Yo, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, sorry I haven't filmed in so long. Um, there has been a lot of stuff going on in my life. And thank you for everyone that hasn't really been asking too much questions because I don't want to talk about it. I don't need to talk about it. So thank you. But, yeah, today we're going to get to know me. There's some questions, obviously, that, pardon me, that you lot have asked. There's some questions that I got from the internet. Simply just a quick video. So before the video starts, make sure to like already, subscribe, and yeah, share it if you can, if you want to, because you share, you like, you subscribe, you do all of that. It just means that I will just keep filming, filming. But I am sorry for not bringing any videos out right now. You're just gonna see me eating. That's it. You're just gonna see me eating, answering questions. Um, make sure to follow me on Instagram and Snapchat at MarcusJ17. Um, make sure to check out all the links in the description below for some stuff. Yeah. Um, next week I'm gonna try to do my best to get some stuff to do a giveaway, maybe. So I hope you enjoyed the video and let's get into it. Seven, no matter what. Sorry, sorry, sorry. First question is, how do you keep grinding 24/7 no matter what happens, and how do you stay motivated? All right. The grinding 24-7, yeah, is, like, hard, obviously hard work pays off in it, like, with ball, like, it's not just, like, one match you play, you're going to be, like, signed, it's over a certain amount of time in it, so, like, that's the whole point, like, I work so hard to stay consistent and, um, like, I hope it pays off from, black like, so I can provide for my family, give them what they want and that. Um, and how I stay motivated is for family, because this is good, wow, yeah, for family, because I know that when I do get to where I want to be, I'll be able to take care of them, and my future family that is not here yet, so that's that question, I guess. Mm. Best clothing brand, all right. I'm gonna say it's 24 London simply because the clothes they bring out, um, not only the material is good, but the clothes they bring out you can kind of wear. I'd wear all the time. There are some clothing brands coming up that are quite sick that like, I do like Trapper Stone, all of that, but I don't own it. I only like one Trapper Stone tee, but it would be 100% 24 London. To the world, I'm actually wearing 24 London now for my trousers. <laughs> Some of your questions are like people trying to flirt with me. I don't flirt, I don't know how to flirt. Someone said, Why do you smell so bad? You smell bad, you smell like off egg. When are you wife me? P.S. You're already ugly. Well, right now, with no trim, yeah, I guess I'm ugly, innit? What? Where do you see yourself in five and ten? Wow, it's raining so much. Where do you see yourself in five and ten, five to ten years? In five years, I want to be playing at the highest level I can. I want my business to be grown. I want my YouTube channel to be grown. I want to be able to inspire people and travel the world. In five years, in ten years, I want to be proper, like settled. Like I have everything in order. So in ten years, I'll be thirty. 25 is a better age. I hope to have a kid by 25. I hope to have loads of money by 25. A wife by 27. Or something like that. 25, 27. But hopefully, them years, everything that I have asked for, I will receive. Someone asks, when did I start playing football? I started playing football when I was about 5 or 6. Five or six, um, yeah, that like local team in like Labour Grove, Latin Rose, called New Hope. Alright, cool. These are questions from the internet. I just want to ask them questions because 
the other ones I liked. Um, how old were you when you put, when you learned how to ride a bike? I was about six years old, or less than that, less than that, younger than that. <laughs> um, what would you name your daughter if you had one? Annabella, no. Anna Maria, no. Valentino, no. I don't know. I let my wife choose them. Yeah. If I had a boy, I'd be called Gianni or Giovanni. Wait. What's your favorite? What was your favorite TV show when you were a kid? Keenan and Kel, because he used to go. Who loves orange soda? Kel loves orange soda. I do, I do, I do. Ooh. Remember that. Did your mom go to college? I don't think she did, but I think she no, she didn't. But she went to uni. Mom's story is quite fascinating. Maybe one day I'll have a, I'll do a video of my mom. See how well she really knows me. That was dang. I have more food, by the way. Mm -mm. The first amusement park you went to, I think it was Fort Park, yeah, and like, it was really hot, but then it got really cold all of a sudden, and I went on like a ride where you're on a swing and then it spins round, and like they have like um, water that comes up, like squirts you, and I was like, I went up twice in a row, and I sat on the bit where you get squirted a lot, and it got really cold, and then I got really ill, and then I just like, I started to go really wet. And I got really, really ill. Like, but it was such a good day. <laughs> um, if you have a nickname, what is it? My nickname, to my friends, obviously my initials, which is MJ. But my nickname growing up was, in my mom, for my mom, it was Bucks. Like, B-U-C-K-S, like Bucks. No idea why. Never wanted to use it as like a nickname. Name. I could have, but I didn't want to. Maybe I should bring it back. What do you think? If you can call me Box, I don't think so. My mum still calls me Box to this day, though. Um. Um. My nickname from my family was Marquinhos. Or Marquinho. My granddad called me that. My dad called me Scritch. Screech, screech, something from Nickelodeon, like kid, some guy with curly, like a nerd from some TV show with curly hair. Don't know why, but yeah. Um, can you whistle? <whistles> yeah. Um. <laughs> Have you broken any parts of your body? Okay, I dislocated, I sprained. This arm, I didn't break it, I broke this arm. Um, I was in a wheelchair for a bit because I popped a nerve in my back, in my, my spine at the top, and I broke my leg. I was really young when I broke my leg. Every story is quite weird. The ones where I broke my arm, I, I was in goal. The first one broke my, well, sprained my arm, I don't know where I did my arm. Um, I was like eight, and I was in goal. My uncle didn't know I was in goal, he turned and shot really quick. And my arm just went and just snapped. Um, the second one, we was playing football in the park with my two cousins. And my cousin, like, pushed my other cousin. And I was on the floor and then my hand went back and snapped again. But it was this one. And then my leg, obviously my dad's a professional wrestler. And I was in the, I went to the show early and I was in the ring. And I done a 6 for 9 But then my leg got caught. And then, like, like I think I sprayed my ankle on my leg. I can't remember. I was really, like, 7 years old, 6 years old. And I didn't know, I carried on walking, but I, it wasn't like in place properly. And then I walked around for like 20 minutes and then I started to cry. And then the doctor, the ambulance there, come back for the rest of the show, come over to me and was like, you're right. And I told him and then, yeah. Um, <laughs> and then my, my spine, my the wheelchair, I flipped the ball forward, pushed it. And then someone slide tackled me. As I slide tackled me, the guy running from behind clipped a nerve and it was snowing up.
my favorite drink. Mango juice, like fresh mango juice. Fresh mango juice. My favorite animal is either a lion or gorilla. Yeah, a lion or a gorilla. Mm -mm. My favorite holiday was probably <sighs> Colombia when I went when I was 15. Probably, probably. Do I have any siblings? Yes, I have one little baby brother. He's bars. No, I'm joking, he's so cute. Did you like school? I hated school so much. I just loved like the banks and that. I hated it. But I would honestly recommend to take school seriously because now I'm not in school. I wish I took it seriously. Um, yeah, stay in school, kids. Awesome. One of my favorite YouTubers are probably um, obviously I watch the Ace Family a lot. I watch Trey and Allo and I watch David Dobrik because I think they're fucking funny. <laughs> my favorite TV shows, um, Friends. I've watched it so many times, like growing up, and I still watch it to this day. If I was to go on Netflix on my phone right now, I'm watching it from I'm watching it all over again. Um, Brooklyn Nine Nine. Power right now is Love Island. Um, I didn't really like Love Island, but um, yeah, my ex like really like put me watch it one time, and I got really hooked on it. <laughs> um, what phone do you have? I have an iPhone 6s Plus. I should have got the seven or the X when I when I got this phone, but I didn't want to. Um, I'm gonna eat more food now. Um, PC or Mac? Cool. You know what, yeah, I'm about to edit this video, like, I film this video, I'm probably going to try to bring it out today as you're watching, um, like, mm. yeah. um, yeah, peace, uh, Mac, 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 100% Mac, it's easier. Mm -hmm. How tall are you? I am 5 foot 6, I am actually very small, uh, do you have any pets? No, I used to have a fish. Bot knows what his name was, but I used to have a fish. And they all died. I like five, they all died. I have a dog. Don't know what to the dog. I used to have a rabbit, apparently. I don't remember. What would you... Wait, no. My favorite book. Never read a book like that, unless it was for school. The only book I read was, um, some Lionel Messi book and I was recently. But other than that, like, I don't really read. Listen to pod oh shit. Listen to podcasts. Um What's your favourite store? My favourite stores are Top Man, Bershka, and Pull and Bear. Simply, like I'm starting to like Zara, but Anything I find in Zora, I can find in Pull'em Bear. You know what I'm saying? Anything I find in Top Man, I can find in Pull'em Bear. Oh no. First car. Anything I find there, I can find anywhere. But Zora, it's just that like, you can find better stuff in Zora. Like my outfit on my Insta, the one in white. That outfit, the top was on sale for like £7, and the bottoms are from. Bershka for £9. Bershka? No, Pull and Bear for £9. They're not even the same thing and it somehow it worked. So I could have bought the whole thing from Zara, but no, I didn't want to. Um, my favourite restaurant. I don't have one. I don't have one. Unfortunately, I don't have a favourite restaurant. Um, my favorite perfume. Don't have one. <laughs> uh, 
Uh, um, I hope you enjoyed the video. It was literally just a quick video because I haven't filmed in so, 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 so long. But I'm gonna make sure the video, another video comes up this week during the week. Um, but yeah, so to make sure to like, comment, subscribe, uh, share. Um, but yeah, do all of that. And I hope you enjoyed the video and safe.